incredibly important that we knock on the head this idea that it's 80%, that the affordable uh, price is 80% of the, of the, of the market rent. It's, it's, uh, the average is 65%, so it can be right down uh, at, uh, at 40% or, or whatever. 80% is the absolute limit, and most people are charging nothing, nothing like that. We've already built a record number of such affordable homes, uh, 78,000 affordable homes. And let me tell you, in one year of uh, this administration in London, there were more council homes built than in 13 years of Labour's administration. Now put that in your pipe and smoke it. Thank you very much for that small rippleette, that small rippleette of, of applause for that. that, that. And, and just on the who can afford it, I, I would just make this, make this, this point that uh, one of the things I think is grossly unfair about the current state of the London property market is that it's only people, uh, as, as everybody knows, that, that it's grossly inflated now. It is, it's, it, the, the multiple of uh, house prices to incomes is way out uh, of line with what it should be. Many, many millions of people are finding it difficult to get onto the property ladder. But if you go for one of our schemes, like First Steps, uh, where we will help you to buy a share in the value of your property, then uh, where we've helped already uh, tens of thousands, I think about 35, 36,000 people, I'm looking to see if Rick Blakeway, the housing guru, is here, uh, uh, onto that scheme, and on average, the household income there is about 30, 33,000 pounds. And uh, those people are getting a share in the value of the London property market. That is, one, that is one very important thing, but the most important thing of all is to increase supply and to build hundreds of thousands of good new homes in London. To answer the question about the Green Belt, no, we won't do it in the Green Belt. We won't build on the Green Belt. It is not necessary. There are huge numbers of brownfield sites already, like this place where we, where we are now, here in, uh, in Greenwich, that can be uh, brilliantly uh, used for uh, good quality housing, and that's where we should go first. We think we can build about 400,000 new homes, good new homes for Londoners on the 33 opportunity areas that I've described. Mr. Mayor, you've been in power since 2008. How many homes have been built in that time? Well, I've given you the figure for the number of affordable homes, which is about 78,000. Yes. So you've done 78,000 And we're on target to do 100,000. Over six years. Is that, is that satisfactory? Well... It's, it's more than have ever been done before. That, that wasn't the question, Mr. It's Mayor. More, is that it's, satisfactory? Uh, uh, there's no, but there's been, uh, it's not, but there's been no time, uh, just to stress, there's been, if you look at the map of housing supply in London in the last century, the, uh, we are running at roughly the levels it's been yeah, it's, it, it's since, the, the best year was in 1933 or thereabouts, when, it went, when there was a massive spike in, in house building. But and and uh, I, what you say is completely correct, but it is what we're going through now is, I think, a massive housing boom. And if you if you look but, at if you look at where if you look at where we're going to be in two years, hang on, let's listen to time, the mayor. Make yourself there known are going to one of the to be a phenomenal number of homes built over the next two years. But we're well, dealing, what's a phenomenal, we're dealing, Mr. Mayor? Dealing, what is a phenomenal we're, number? We're, we're what dealing, is a I phenomenal think, number? I, I I would not be. I mean, I just you know I'm I, I'm I'm wagering here, but I would not be surprised if uh, in the next two years we build a record number uh, by f more than have ever been built over the last 30 years. Well, what yeah. number would that be? How many build are you building per, per annum currently? Well, uh, I've, given you, I've, given you, I've given you the figure. You work it out. I've given, you, I've given you the figure for what we've already achieved. I've said that we're on target to, uh, to deliver more than but you, uh, 100,000 over two terms. Uh, that, 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 and that is a bigger rate of, well, of the, house building, the, the reality of is that affordable you want home to be building, building than we have ever seen. Mr. Mayor, the reality is you want to be building 42,000 per do. annum. You're currently building 21,000. We, we want to be building 49,000. Yes, yeah, you're currently building at the rate of 21,000. We, we, want, we want to be building 40. But right. what, we're, what we're dealing with is 30 years of chronic failure to deal with London's housing need. And uh, it is now starting to take off. We're now starting to see the numbers climb. But uh, you, you've got to be very directional and very positive, and you've got to tell people sometimes uh, that they can't be too uh, nimbyish. And uh, you know, I, 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 sometimes I, I take it quite. You know, I, there are schemes that I greenlight uh, that we get going, and I'm thinking, and people will be familiar. I, every day I get through the, or every week I get through the, the mail 
the, the letterbox in where, where I live, uh, the Islington Tribune denouncing me uh, for trying to get some scheme going at, at Mount Pleasant, uh, which will deliver thousands of homes for Londoners. And, and, and so they don't like it because they don't like the design, they think it's too dense. And, and I just, all I'm saying respectfully to people, I think it's a beautiful design, by the way. It'll be a wonderful place to live. And what I'm saying to people, we can't have it all ways. We can't insist that uh, we, we build uh, you know, rows of thatched cottages uh, or, or whatever it is that people uh, want to live in and simultaneously cope with our massive need for housing. We can build beautiful schemes. And sometimes I, I think that if I may respectfully say to some of my friends and colleagues in the boroughs, sometimes they can be a little bit slow to get those things off the ground. I mean, look, we've just been talking today about Convoy's Wharf in Deptford. Anybody like Con the Convoy's Wharf in Deptford? Okay. It's, uh, maybe it's not... It's, so there you go. Now, that's the voice of, 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 of non-progress. Right. Someone says it's, it's a disaster. It's, a, it's not Shout, a... No, sh let's it's, just been, it's been just, derelict Mr. for Mayor, 17 Mr. Mayor, years. Mr. Mayor, it's and it's been people saying Mr. Mayor, it's a disaster Mr. Mayor, uh, that have stopped, it's it's stopped anybody building, building Sir, homes. just shout in a sentence. Why is Convoy's Wharf a disaster? The local council don't want it. They represent local people. The local council don't want it. And what, why don't... I can't see where you are. Sorry. social... There's not enough social housing there in an area. South East London needs homes that people can afford to live in. Convoy's Wharf will not demand that. It will not give, it will give, not give that at all. Because it too expensive. Because, because it's too expensive for people to live in. Okay, they you're start at 270. You're the one that's dreaming, not, uh, not us. Okay, okay. That's the voice you chose to pick a local just up the road there, Convoy's Wharf in Deptford. There seems to be considerable opposition. Back to you, Mr. Well, Mayor. Well, uh, again, I've just got, I've just got to uh, repeat my point that unless you, unless you get these schemes going. You get absolutely no housing there at all. That, but this that's gentleman's like, saying they're, they're that, unaffordable. They'll probably well, start at well, 280. There, there will be plenty of affordable. There is plenty of affordable housing on the site. There is 40, I think 40% 40 of, of the Convoys Wharf site, thank you, uh, Eddie, is, is affordable. Now, you can, now what, you're, what you're really advocating, what you're, if what, what you're really Let's seem to hear, be advocating is 40%... 40% of nothing. All right. And I don't think that is a sensible way forward. What London needs is good new homes, and that Convoy's Wharf site has been derelict for 17 years because right. of apathy, drift, and dither. And uh, all I'm saying, respectfully, is, is you can't have it always. Okay, uh, let's if, take... we, if, you, if we want more housing, which we do, then sometimes we've got to blast ahead and get on with it.